Hello and welcome back to EU4 and the Poland and Sweden Let's Play with me and Daniel. Uh, yes. Napoleon Bonaparte. <laughs> channel branding. The rebranding, yeah. I. Well, he hello. Hello there. Welcome. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> oh, God, you piece of turd. Just announcing them. Announcing me as the new rival. <laughs> yeah, I had a little bit of a uh, branding, rebranding of the channel. You know, I just felt like it really. Mm. I, I, I kind of like a historical figure better than someone I've. Well, it's not made up. It's still historical. But, you know. Yeah. A group of people. <coughs> it just didn't feel right for me. It See, I, I just. My first channel was called Brilliant and Warrior, which is why mm -hmm. I have, like, in my channel URL, it says slash Brilliant and Warrior rather than mm -hmm. slash Luba Force Network. Uh, and I just thought that's a bit. Crap! So I just changed it, and I I don't I don't I actually like my name now. I don't know if it's that good to other people, yeah. but I like it. The Lubercourse Network. It sounds very professional. It'd be good if it, if it was actually a network, but I'm never going to be able to do that. And I don't think I'd want to put myself in a position where I would steal a percentage of someone's like hard work, which is what pretty much most networks do. Uh, Freedom Network. To be oh. more precise. I keep getting emails off them asking me yeah. to join them back and I'm just like no please go away I never, I get want, I never want to give you like 200 quid that time that happened yeah but I you, sort of, uh, you stole your money pretty much yeah. I'll never I'll never join you a network again to be honest mm -hmm. conquer Gotland well, I don't have a navy to do that so where is Gotland oh it's that it's the island isn't it have it create a proper fleet well, I, have, be a good I, I I don't have any ships either. I can't really afford a fleet, that's the thing. Bastardy. Bastardy. I think I'm going to go to war with Denmark again and try and free Norway and yeah. maybe uh, steal. That's pretty much all you can do. I'm going to try and steal Finnmark off them. Finnmark. I think. And I need to go to a war with Novgorod as well. Get some of their land. Possibly oh. Finland, I reckon. Piece of. Finland. shit. I keep on forgetting to turn off the steam overlay. Like every single episode, <coughs> religiously. What, what Diplex heated comes online? Yeah. This <laughs> is like starts flaring a game. Uh, oh shit! Right. I don't know what to do. I'm just gonna like sit here and probably dribble for another twenty minutes. Well, I can't really do a lot. I, I think. Do you think I should have the ultimate goal of girl of forming Scandinavia? Yeah, that'd be pretty cool. As long as it doesn't mean you have to encroach on Polish, on Polish territories. Well, I won't do. It'll just be Scandinavia. I do want to conquer Denmark. I think that'd be quite. That'll be like the next step, though. Come fuck up the poles. Still have a I'm, truce with them. There'll like be a big attack on God. Danzig or something, and I'm gonna start screaming and crying and crying and screaming. Scandinavian conquest of Danzig. Uh, I would actually like some territory across the pond, possibly somewhere like. Livonian order. But oh, they're not going to exist for much longer. Ah, uh, so you're going to steal them. You could like go deep penetrate Russia. Deeply penetrate them. Who's Novgorod? Pomeranian. Novgorod Fredo. should be really weak, but Muscovy's been a bit of a twat and has failed to fuck them up. It's like, what are you doing, son? Hmm. They've actually got higher military tech than me. I don't even think if Novgorod. I don't think if I went to war, people would join me anyway. Ah, oh, no. What's gotta? Well, maybe because they don't want to die. I can understand that. I, I don't know if it's a good idea being allied with England and Scotland. Do you? Mm, mm, perhaps not. Which one's the better one? Well, England. Let's have a look. Got a bigger army, but then Scotland is allied with. France, and so they are ultimately going to go to war, and then I'm going to have to pick, and I think I'd probably pick England to join. Yeah, England does, of course, have a bigger army, and better economy, and bigger fleet, but they're currently at war with Ulm, Baden, Salzburg, and Ravensburg. Is it just the English against them? Allied with you, Austria, and Florence... Austria is also at war, okay. Because it is the Austrian conquest of Memmingen. Which they've Memmingham. 
Memmingham. Memmingham. Oh god, it's pissing it down outside. Brilliant. Not here. I wish it was here. I like it when it's raining inside. We've had l yeah, same. We've had lots of rain yesterday. <laughs> How's that work? I phrased that wrong, actually. I like it when it's raining inside. <laughs> um, I like it when it's raining outside when I'm inside. That's what I meant to say. There we go. I do want to take Gotland, but I need a navy, so I'm probably going to have to create a proper Looks like a first. bit of a shithole to me. Actually, no. It's got better base tax on that one island than two of your mainland provinces combined. Yeah. Oh, wow. Holy yeah. shit. Lapland and Vassabotan and Jumpland and Dus Dalaskorgan combined will then only be able to to make your uh, conquer stop. <laughs> um that sounds alright. Or create a new army for our nation also sounds like a better one. When are you gonna create the Commonwealth with with Lithuania? Uh when I can get them to be mine, to be honest. Do you have to, does it have to be like uh 190 relations and tell you war. when I can do it. I have to. <clears throat> <clears throat> oh god, it's coughing. I can have administrative technology at least 10 and stability at least 1. Then I can form the uh, Commonwealth. And I'll get a base tax in novice sex and 25 prestige. And also, obviously, be a huge united country. Oh. Which I'm looking forward to. And my mic is about to run out. Well, my headset, which is brilliant. Right, I will run out be a sec. Of... Okay. Carry on. Oh, I'll carry on. Very good. Why not? Well, there's entertainment factor in solo play. You know, you know what solo play is like. Um, got a few. I've actually now got to compensate for my channel and and Lewis's channel. Well, I don't know if you can hear me, but he might do. If his mic's died, then I wouldn't imagine so. But, you know, it's possible. But yeah, there's a lot of compensation going on here. Oh no, here we go. Hello. There we go. Alright. I mean, it was, it, was, it was tough, but I think I did it. I, I think it's That's fine. Good. Yeah. My sister yeah. went on holiday to Ireland. Well, not on holiday, for a week in the way. And then um, stole my USB, so I couldn't charge my mic, which is just... Oh, nice. What was fantastic. she using it for? Uh, for her phone. She's got one of them plug sockets that, like, you can plug in a USB to it. Oh, yeah, I've got... I just got a new phone recently, um, and I've got that. It's like oh. all, the, all the modern phones have it. Yeah. Actually, not even well, modern. Well, iPhones have it, don't they? So. Yeah. Just um, like most phones have it. Oh, I think I was in, yeah, I was improving relations with Scotland just to make <laughs> make compensations. Um, we're married and we're allied. Okay, that's in, good. In my Ottoman like single player campaign, um, mm. Brittany actually survived. Like I, I'm at like Smith, like nearing on the 1800s and Brittany is still around, right? Wow. And they've got a massive empire. Like they earn about. A third of Amer of North America. Holy shit! They earn like lures of East Africa, and they've got colonies in Australia or New Zealand. One of them, mm. and it's just like, what? Like France has been so shit in that in that campaign. It's like it's basically in a battle between the Ottomans, cause uh, Spain and Portugal. Like we have been like going at it, good and hard. Who who are you? And oh, the you're the Ottomans. Yeah, going at it, good and hard. What? How is Portugal like in the running? Like I don't know. They've just you'd got imagine a huge Spain empire. would just shit all over them. The huge. Uh, well, it's well, what it is is because Spain and Portugal are allied, and oh, they're allied with France as well. Oh, so it's Christ. like a little triple alliance, then, and it's just me in the east. Like, How, where have you taken over? Have you like gone into Hungary and Austria? Uh, no, because this is a Commonwealth up there, and the Commonwealth earns like probably from Neva, which is like. In Novgorod, like next to, uh, where? What um, is that place? It's Saint Petersburg. That's there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That from is Saint Saint, Saint Petersburg all the way down to like whatever ocean that is. Not the Black Sea, the one next to it. To the, the Gulf right. of Varna. No. 
To the left, you mean? To the right. The Caspian Sea? Yeah. And they earn all the way down there, and then they Holy earn, like, shit. half of, like, Bohemia. And then, so it's like, if I go to all of that, I'm oh, just going to get wrecked. That's what it's going to look like um, after a couple of episodes here. <laughs> I'm going to just fuck up the world. So basically, I've, like, been focused on the Middle East. I've spread it, like, halfway through Persia. I've taken most of, like, the uh, East Africa. So, Brittany has West Africa, shall I say. I've taken most of, like, East Afri Africa, so all the way down to, like, Ethiopia, and now I'm, like, trying mm -hmm. to get towards South Africa. Uh, all right. Yeah. I don't have any, like, territories anywhere else, really. But at some point, I'm just going to need to, like, form an alliance with someone and then just go to, to town on them. Yeah. Good Muscov a, is huge, good by the way. Muscovy owns, like, most of Russia. They still Russia. haven't formed Russia. No. It's, cra it's a really weird campaign. Do they hold, like... Does Moscow exist? Yeah, it does. Yeah, Do they, they hold, hold Moscow. Moscow. Okay. They don't hold Neva. Maybe they need to hold Neva in order to, in order to form... Yeah. The wonderful territory. I don't know. Maybe. 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 Oh, you dirty, dirty Teutonic Order rebel separatist pieces of twatting pain on the backside. Oh, I almost lost that one, actually. Oh, God, every time I get close to getting above my force limit, a <laughs> fucking rebellion happens. Can't take it anymore. <clears throat> sounds, ah. like, sounds okay. This marketplace in Steeland. I'll mm. get twelve gold per turn extra, which would be very well. You won't actually get twelve. Twelve gold. What will I get then? You'll get like point twelve. What? You get like it zero point twelve. Oh, fuck off! Where, where did the rebels... Oh, okay, down there. Alright, fair enough. Shit, why can't I boot him out? You won't actually get 12 gold, because that'd just be massively amazing. So what do I get then? Like, what's the point of it saying plus 12? Because it's like... that that That's trade power. Again. Oh, right. Grand Ball in Warsaw. Hmm. Mm. Yeah. I always thought that. Oh yeah, trade they, path. They, they lied to you, basically. You got lied to. It's just a misunderstanding. It's just a misunderstanding. Alright, I just need to, like, speed it now. It's like nothing either of us can do, apart from sit here and watch. Ooh. Actually, who are the Teutonics? Allied with Denmark in the Livonian Order. How boring and shit. Of course. The bottle of Skein is lost. <laughs> oh, not Skein. 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 Still got another 2,000 men to reinforce before I can fucking get a positive manpower. Mm? Good. Oh, mm? god Goodbye. damn it, that is bad. What? Influence, uh, quarantine the port, that's all I can really do. Have you got positive manpower? I've got 22,000. Interesting. Oh, okay. That's good. Good for you. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I don't. Excellent. Bronze cannons. Holy shit. What the fuck? What kind of tech are the Ottomans on? Seven. I need money. I'm on four. I, yeah, I'm, I'm on military on tech level four. I'm on f uh, four as well, yeah. Holy shit. I've got quite a shit king in terms of yeah, same. Um, I've got... My king gives me administrative power 3, mm. diplomatic and military power 5, which is very bad. Oh, military's good. Why, what are you getting? Military and diplomatic are very good for you. Um, I got... I'm getting a 441. Oh. My next king is a 352. How do you like... How do you look at the next king? Uh, it says your heir. Karol Fenan Jagelin. Is your next one good? Uh, well, he's got good diplomatic. Six one three. Though. Holy shit! That was very good. Yeah, but no, one six one. Sorry, three administrative. Feet. Yeah, but his diplomatic power is just dreadful, and his military is shite as yeah, well. Yeah, just get advisors for that one then. I've got advisors for this one as well. I mean, I've had to get an advisor that gives me two military 
points, and he costs 4.6 per month. It's absolutely outrageous. Outrageous. That's why I'm going to be really behind him. Oh, also because obviously I'm not Western. I've got my one of my military one of my ideas is military as well, so that's like using up my mm, thing as that's well. That's true. So I'm at least at least you're Westernized. I'm not Westernized. I'm Eastern. No. Eastern tech. Indeed. So now I can advance. Hurrah! Superior unit types. Eastern militia. They're just so shit. It's unreal. Just so shite. Absolute shite shit. Absolute shit on my plate. Oh, oh, yes. Oh, oh, okay. It's not actually showing me my balance. There we go. It was like glitched out, not telling me. Uh -huh. mm, can I actually. How do you find out your naval force limit? Uh, it says it on the military screen. You can press zero. Oh, army force limit. Mine is 23 22. out of 38. Mine's 22. Zero mm. out of 22, by the way. So I need to get 75% to have a decent fleet. Well, I'll just get a little cogs. It's an offer. We can refuse. Um, yeah, we can refuse his offer. We don't need to slut ourselves out. Well, we do, but um, we don't want to. Hungry. Do you hate me? No, you don't actually. Ah, they're in personal union under Austria. Fuck. Ah, so powerful. It's like Austria is me, but like less Eastern. <laughs> Hungry, Western or Eastern? It's Eastern. God damn it! God fucking damn it! God darn it! Uh, the Ottomans are gonna cause huge. <clears throat> Well, I think we should call it an end hither. Okay, if you insist. And writers Muscovy and Novgorod are going at it like dogs. Oh yeah. So yeah. Cutting, like Thank you all for watching this episode. Please do stay tuned for the next one, and obviously give us a like if you enjoyed this episode and the series as a whole. Please subscribe if you haven't already, and uh, we will see you in the next episode. Goodbye. Bye.